Look at that. There is a fish on the, there is a fish on the end of that. Gotta calm down, gotta calm down. There's a fish making off of that person's float. Wow, he's moving fast. Okay, here we go. Oh, almost, 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 almost. Man, he's quick. We're not gonna have very many shots at this. Ah, missed it again. <laughs> Keep your balance. Look at it go. Calm down, Peyton. Calm down. Man, we're gonna lose our chance. smokes wow that's not even my fish i caught i caught somebody's float holy smokes wow that's oh my god that is a tank of a speck no wonder somebody lost it see that that's mine right there that lure <laughs> on that little spoon Oh, right now, anything that bites. Yeah, no I saw that thing booking it, that float, and I knew there had to be something on the end of it. Good, good. Look at this tank you caught. Good lord. Okay, you are, sir. Thank you, man. Absolutely. Wow. Absolutely massive. Monster. I thought it was a red when I saw it coming in. Yeah. At the jetties on Surfside. Good lord. Absolute tank. Wow. You might got tape? <laughs> it's a keeper. Yeah, <laughs> you see how oh, big well, it is? I know that. No, no, no kidding. Looks like a 26, wow. 25 inch. He's got all kinds of hooks in these things. more. Go up on now. I think my hook's too big. I'm yeah. using a circle hook and I can't gotcha. get like yeah. the little sand trout. I can't get a good hook set right. on them. Right. So my hook's too big, right? Maybe. All right. All right I'll take that. I'm going right. to. Incredible. You want to give it a quick measure? Yeah. Just be real gentle. I don't want to put him on the concrete. Touch the concrete too much. Real quick, brother. Just don't worry about pinching. Just yeah, we'll just get an estimate. What did I say? Yeah. 27. Wow. <laughs> Incredible. Incredible fish. Wow. Incredible. Thank you so much, guys. Great job. Wow. That is a, a heck of a fish, guys. Never saw that coming. Just keep your eyes peeled. I mean, people lose fish all the time. And then their, uh, their floats just end up going out to sea. I'm gonna try to revive this guy a little bit. Yeah, we'll get, our, we'll get our feet in the water for this guy. He's worth it. Incredible animal. Get out of here. There he goes. Come on. Swim, swim, swim. Swim. Hold him here for a minute. I really don't want to kill this fish. I really don't want to kill it. I'm just gonna try to revive him.
I'm gonna stay here as long as this takes. Well, that's amazing. That keeps happening to me. <laughs> I keep catching all these uh, pretty good fish by uh, hook and floats that are getting busted off. Last time I did that, I almost drowned. Um, if you haven't seen that video, I, I tried to uh, hand line in an alligator car that I busted off and it dragged me in the water with the line wrapped around my hand. But uh, in this case, it worked out well for everyone, including the fish. So somebody was, you know, using, looks like, you know, either pre-made or kind of cheaply thrown together gear. They're used to the float that I saw and they just had, it looks like a mix of uh, soft plastic and like cut bait on a mix of hooks. It's kind of ridiculous. But uh, yeah, I just saw that float just booking it. Had a cast out there and got it. And luckily we were able to put the fish back. I was afraid it wasn't gonna recover, but it did. So really, really happy with that. That's a fantastic, fantastic encounter today. I'm so glad I made the decision to come out here this morning. Anyway, that'll do it for us. To, oh, and huge thanks to the guys down there, by the way, for helping me with the, the handling of the fish and uh, the filming. I forgot, to get the, I forgot to get your name, but if you find this video and you're watching, thank you. Uh, but yeah, more is coming, guys. Uh, stay tuned. Check out the Patreon page. The link's in the description. Check out Wildlife's Outdoor Cooking, um, where that fish almost ended up if he didn't survive getting put back in, but... Luckily, he did. Um, Wildlife's Outdoor Cooking is where we do all the catch and cooks and other food stuff. Uh, you can find a link to that on our homepage as well as in the description of this video. Hit description, open it up, you'll see the links for the Patreon, links for the other channel. Uh, check out both of those. Definitely subscribe to the uh, Wildlife's Outdoor Cooking. All right, guys, more is coming. Stay tuned. Until it's here, I'll see you guys later.